Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I have an update for the Happy Blue Year project for you. This one of course was started within the Discord that Alexi and Rebecca started and Voided Lux was the main person that kind of got everybody together to come up with this team. Um, we're doing a lot of like blue teams related prompt in here. I'm just gonna jump right in and show you how I've been doing. Starting off with one of the products that has been in here the longest, my Rimmel Apocalypse Lip Lacquer in Apocalyptic. Been wearing this a fair bit still. Not as much as I hoped I would because now that we're going back into the office and I'm wearing a mask a little bit more often, it gets a little bit harder to actually wear this because I don't wanna have this underneath my mask and like make my mask all dirty from the inside so I've been wearing like a more neutral lip gloss a little bit more often but I still managed to use this 11 times which brings me to a total of 69 uses I had 58 uses before and the windows are starting to show more and more every time I dip my uh, doe foot thingy in here I notice that there's less product that's being picked up so I still hope that I can get the stopper out within the next one or two months but I also know I'm wearing this less than I usually would. So we're gonna have to see how this is gonna go. I really hope I can kick this one out soon-ish at least. Then, one that I feel like haven't, hasn't been in here that long yet, but it is one of like the older products for this project, is the NYX Sweet Cheeks Matte Bronzer. Um, I'm making okay progress on this. I'm using this on a pretty much daily basis. Um, we've been on a little trip away. I've said that in multiple videos in which I haven't been wearing makeup for a week. So that made the progress a little bit less, but I can clearly see the little like hump <laughs> in the pan, um, which I don't know whether you can see that very well from the close up, but yeah, that's all we've got for now. I don't know when I'm gonna hit the pan on it, but. I'm wearing it pretty much every day to just contour a little bit and then whatever is left on it I put kind of on my temples and up but that's not too much product anymore so that's what I'm doing with that one. Then a C team product, did I actually say what the teams were? Space Teams Apocalypse Lipstick and this was a lucky charm just because it is the perfect like contour shade for me. The Jelly Pong Pong Lip Blush um, in the red shade is sea themed because jellyfish. <laughs> I did not make a whole lot of progress on this one. I used this one three times, I think. Yep, yeah. three times, which brings me to a total of 15. So that isn't really enough to like remake a lot of progress on it. But as I've said before, this just is my main shade to focus on. And this one I use every now and then. I am wearing it today because I thought at least I could get another use out of it before I filmed this, but yeah. Um, this is gonna get more focus once the Apocalypse one is pretty much gone. Then moving on to a blue packaging one. This is one of the more boring products, I think, when it comes to showing you guys, because it is the Maybelline Fit Me powder. It's a powder, I use this every time I do my makeup. Um, I only have one powder, and especially on like, the one side, it is getting a little bit lower. You can definitely see it's been used, but it's a powder. Like I'm going through it slowly but surely. I don't know how deep that pan is, so we will find out soon, I hope. And then for a cool toned flip, like a shade with a cool toned flip, my black shade in the Lancome palette has tiny speckles of like silvery blue glitter shimmers in it which you don't see when you put it on your eyes but still my main goal for this one was to try and hit side pan on it and I'm sure you cannot see it from there but in the close-up you can see that I did hit side pan I only did that a couple of days ago um it is so hardly pressed in here it's ridiculous but I've made a little bit of progress again side pan is a really good indicator of like new progress basically but it's gonna take me some time to get through this one um as you guys know, I've used up an okay amount of black shades by now, but that one definitely is a hard one to get through. 
and also that one I use on a pretty much daily basis as my eyeliner at least and sometimes to darken up my crease if I don't have anything else already in there. Then lastly I have another shade from my Amuse palette in here and this is a shade that complements blue and like right in the color wheel kind of across blue is orange so I went for a orangey shade it's not actual orange orange because it's a peachy shade more but this is what I'm working on I have this on the inner part of my eyelids today I don't know how well you can see that but that is what I have partly on my lids at least I think I've used it three or four times so far same thing as I've been saying for a lot of different videos now I was still doing my 365 days of eyeshadow so I was just really trying to get through the last eyeshadows in the project and now I went through all my eyeshadows so now my focus is going to be more on all these shades again but I still got four uses out of it you can see it's been used now which is nice so yeah that is uh, the main things that I wanted to show you guys I don't think I will have anything rolling out next time I'm like secretly hoping that I can pull out the stopper maybe for this one next time and throw it on the floor um but yeah i don't know whether that's gonna happen um like maybe pan on like the powder or the bronzer who knows but apart from that i'm just gonna keep working on these and hopefully in two updates from now i will have some like more significant progress again on some of these products but that is it for today so thank you guys very much for watching and i hope to see you in one of my next videos bye, -bye.